Hi, my name is Tom. I'm a Green Bay native, grew up on the east side of Green Bay, uh, married a girl from Alloway, and had my surgery done at Tower Clock Eye Center. What got me to look at the panoptic lens was the fact that I had been out hunting in Montana and uh, chasing elk at 10,000 feet and at seven below zero, and um, my glasses fogged up and, and you really can't afford to have that happen if you're if an elk shows up so I knew at that time that it was time for me to to go and look into the panoptic lens because I'd heard about them from Dr. Ty and decided okay this is what's pushing me over the edge. The first meeting with Dr. Tyson was really uh, very comfortable. Uh, you know, when you meet a new doctor, it's always a question of you know how how engaging is he going to be with you, how open, and really, it seemed to me he took all the time that that I needed to answer the questions that I had, uh, and that progressed uh, as we went along. In fact. The day after the first surgery, I went in because they, there was a check, and he was walking down the hall, and, and I just stopped him, and I said, hey, dude, this is great. Let's get the other one done. <laughs> and he was, you know, he was kind of like, whoa, no problems? I go, no, no problems, so. Really, the whole procedure, the, the whole surgical procedure, I really I don't remember much about it. I asked the doctor if uh, he fed the old uh, cataracts to the mice, but and he just kind of laughed at that. But I don't, uh, you know, it was a very ple it wasn't an uncomfortable situation, probably because I had gone through VRK before. But then, uh, you know, I got up and other than sleeping with a patch over my eye the first night, the next morning I was like, whoa, this is pretty cool. If you're looking at this new lens and you um, have an issue with uh, both nearsightedness and farsightedness, this is a remarkable uh, instrument to, to, to try. I, I, I would tell you to do it because it, for me it was perfect. But here's the big thing. When you duck hunt, uh, if you duck hunt enough, you're pretty good at identifying the ducks because they aren't just walking by at a stroll. So uh, what I'm hoping, and I because I had this surgery after the duck season, what I'm hoping for is that um, it will give me a really good opportunity to have a clear vision on those ducks. Now, I was uh, I live on the river in De Pere, and uh, last Sunday we had this little thaw. There were two eagles sitting on the ice, which were probably 300 yards away, and I could identify them. It was really cool. Well, I've noticed that I, uh, you know, other than reading uh, directions on a pill bottle. I, I don't need to have any kind of cheaters. Um, I, I basically work on a computer all day and I don't have any issues with that. Um, so I, I have really, uh, I don't have any issues. I have no negative issues.